Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is G Way. Um, I figure I'll make a few videos. Um, took my swift orientation today, day two. Day two. Um, basically, swift is a truck driver coming for people that don't know, you know. Um, had my CDLs for a while. Got my CDLs back in um, 2006. Um, I'm cooking. I'm trying to get me a steak in before I meet my mentor. You know, mom be out going on that road for six weeks. Don't really want to just be stuck on truck stop food. Anyway, um, what I was saying about the Swift training. Wasn't bad. This, like I say, this is my day two. First day was real simple. First day, you know, you take your DOT physical. Even though I already had my DOT card, just had to update it with them. Go down to the driver's license place and um, had them interstate me so I can drive in and out of state. I had my CDL since 2006. I'll get back to that. Um, after all that, you know, you take your year analysis. You learn how to do your... Um, paperwork you have to fill out. Did most of that today. Uh, as well as, well, that was yesterday. As well as today, you know, you learn do your log books and everything. The DOT physical, I said that already. Not DOT physical, the um, the 34 hour reset rule. You guys out there has already been driving, nobody. I'm trying to catch on to it. Because you don't want to spend your 34 hour reset in hot springs nowhere texas nebraska well you rather spend your 34 hour reset at home so if you can make that happen which i'm kind of getting the concept you can make that happen let me back up a little bit yeah i done had my you're probably wondering okay he got his cdl in 2006 why he just not start truck driving let's call this a Midlife career change. When I got my CDLs, right at the time that I got them, God bless me with custody of my kids. Uh, my kids are mostly grown now. Um, my oldest son graduated college. Um, my daughter is in college. She is in her second year. My youngest is in the 12th grade. He's a senior. Really don't want to be out there on the road like that but you know and I know when one source of income starts drying up them bills do not stop at all so you gotta do what you gotta do um he in good hands though um but I won't be gone like that um with this initial thing you know you gotta be gone six to eight weeks with your trainer no four to six weeks that's one reason I chose Swift Four to six weeks with a trainer. Other companies want to do it a little bit longer. I don't really have time like that. Because as I said before, the bills do not stop no matter what's going on in your life. We know this. Okay? Um, yeah, so I don't think it's a bad career change. You know, did my research on it. Truckers make some pretty good money. Real good money. Um... And I don't work for myself for the past few years. I ain't gonna put the number out there. But I like the idea of this business. You know, you gotta get your feet wet, learn it. Get your own truck. Generate your own income. Make your own hour. Take the trips you wanna take. You know, maybe you own a few trucks, have some people driving for me. You know what they say, you dream, dream big. So, y'all know what that is. Not a commercial form, but you know what that is. Okay? And if you're from South Florida, you really know about this. Yeah. Don't tell nobody. If you don't know, you better ask somebody. So, I'll get these steaks on here in a minute. This oven going. But, yeah. I hope to continue making videos. Have y'all out this on my trek of the videos, my journey, my quest, whatever you want to call it, to see where this leads me. Any information I can pass along and drop to you, 
hey, just send me an inbox. I can answer it. Comment below. I answer it. Like I say, orientation wasn't much. Um, after I meet my mentor, hopefully I'll be able to tell you some more tomorrow. Uh, don't know if I'll be able to make videos while I'm on the road, but believe me, I'll definitely try to keep y'all informed. Um, maybe there's something you might want to do, because honestly, I watched a lot of YouTube videos before I decided to do this, as well as did my other research. But, oh, speaking of that, might as well give him a shout out. Trucker T, yeah, I went with Swift. Holla at you. Hopefully I'll see you on the road, even though I heard you finna leave. Um, Casanova601. Very informative brother. Y'all might want to check him out. Um, he does give a lot of tips about the business, the good and the bad, the ins and outs. Um, Trucker T. Yeah, Trucker T. That, uh, not, not uh, say that wrong. Gave Trucker T a shout out already. Uh, what is his name? The right brother out there, but that's not who I'm trying to shout out. Trucker Brown. Yeah, he um he got some deep videos, especially his early ones. Not saying his newer ones are not deep, but his early ones, you can almost see him progress. You see him progress in the business. So I hope to do those same type of videos, as well as like I said, Casanova Six Hundred One. You see here, it's another trucker video I watch. Uh, the Red Vikings, he's pretty good. Um, Diva. Forty-three, I believe it is. She dropped a lot of knowledge, about a lot of knowledge. Matter of fact, I want to say she's doing a series now on starting your own business in the trucking industry. So I'm just gonna start watching that. I suggest you do too if you consider this a feel for you. And like I said, keep tuned in. Try to subscribe at the bottom. It's on one of them sides, whatever platform you're on, Windows, Android, iPad. It's on one of those sides. But once again, this your boy G Way. I'll be hollering at you soon. Peace.